Hey guys, what's up? So it's Apple Test Stop here, and today I'm showing you guys a Photoshop alternative. So credit does go to iAppleTubers. I found um, this method off of. So you guys go to the websites. Just literally look up uh, photo photopia.com, or just look up Photopia, and it'll come up. And this is the website. So uh, it's pretty cool. And it's really uh, easy to use. So you guys could go to open from computer or whatever. I'm step on a new project, and you guys can pretty much just like Photoshop Touch, which I really missed. There's uh, there was PS Touch. Um, I think it supports iOS 11 and below, and they got updated, unfortunately. But that was like my favorite app, guys. Um, for like editing, I used to edit all my thumbnails on there back in the day, and it was so easy and it was it was awesome. My favorite. Um, I have some alternatives. I can make a video on that if you guys want. Let me know down below. But um, pretty much you can name your project. You can do your width and your height. I leave it at the standard, which is 1280 by 720, and you can do a background white. Uh, you also do a transparent background, which I recommend. Um, well, the thing you're doing, or I'm just gonna do a uh, custom background as well, so you gotta, you know, do whatever. So I'm just gonna do a transparent background, and then we just tap on create. And just like Photoshop, guys, you uh, have all like your pretty much, you know, bunch of tools you guys can use. I'm not gonna through every tool in this video. You guys can just go through it yourself. I don't even, I, I'm not really too familiar with this anyway. It's kind of like the uh, Windows, not Windows, but like the, um, the computer version on your phone, which is pretty cool. So um, that's really it, guys. Um, you can actually add your photo here and, you know, go from there and start editing. And this right here, I know there's different layers. So you save layers, channels, paths, and you just have so much uh, cool stuff. Uh, image, you can actually, uh, you know, image size, transform, apply images. Uh, you have a background, which right now is transparent. Um, but there's a bunch of uh, cool stuff. So move tool, magic wand. Rectangle, image, file. So, after you guys, uh, you know, you guys can save it right here. You do uh, save as uh, PSD, save more, export as, uh, file info. So a lot of uh, stuff you guys can do with this. Um, pretty cool. Actually, it's pretty amazing. But uh, you're here, you have your tets. So you can put, you know, tets on there. And uh, right here is a uh, you know my gallery, or well not my gallery, but gallery. You can put out different photos there. And you know, but yeah, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I'll catch you guys next one. Enjoy. As you see, we put the photo there, and you can um, you know make it smaller taller or do whatever I actually put two by accident. But yeah, thanks for watching guys. Peace.